In the Rome mission, uh, it is very humid. So in the summer, it feels hotter than hot. <laughs> and in the winter, it feels colder than cold. Um, I would say it's a lot like Utah. Not in the sense, I mean, as hot as it gets, it's that and then more because wet. Humidity. Yeah. But it does, it gets cold like Utah. It does not snow like Utah. Um, Rome gets snow maybe once every 10 years. And when there's a couple snowflakes, things close and people go crazy. Um, but in the city I served in, in Sicily, it actually snowed. But we were in, on, on top of a mountain. So it's like Utah, but more to the bone in that sense. Cold is more to the bone, hot, but you're hot and sweaty. For elders, their only hope is short sleeve shirts <laughs> for the summertime. Um, they'll definitely use long sleeve shirts, um, fall and winter. For sisters, especially during the summer, caught, uh, like button up shirts where they don't need an undershirt because they're already wearing one layer and then they have their shirt on top. Shirts that do not call for an undershirt for modesty, I would go for those shirts. Layers. Um, cardigans are wonderful because like anywhere in the morning it's colder, in the evening it's colder, but during the day you can take off your cardigan, your sweater, put it into your bag. Scarves saved my life as a missionary. Scarves can be used around your neck or around as a sweater in itself. Um, and elders will come to learn to use scarves themselves, you know, though they may think it's strange in America, in Italy it's completely acceptable. Tights are really layering up, not just your normal outfit and then a coat, but to, to layer up is what I would suggest. Elders take vests, elders take sweaters to put underneath their coats and uh, socks that they can layer 